King Carl Gustav of Sweden recently marked his remarkable 50th anniversary on the throne with a series of grand celebrations that united the Swedish people in joy and gratitude. The week-long festivities culminated in a spectacular tribute concert at Norbro in Stockholm, featuring renowned artists like Leo Lindfors, Björn Skiffs, Magnus Ugla, and Peter Joback. A Jubilee Year to Remember Throughout the year, King Carl Gustav visited all 21 counties of Sweden, emphasizing his commitment to being the king of all Swedish people. His tireless efforts to connect with his subjects have left no doubt about his dedication to his role. Official Acknowledgements In a grand ceremony attended by dignitaries and business leaders, including Carl Johan Persson and Stefan Persson of H&M, Anna Kinberg Batra, and Per Bill, the king received numerous gifts and honors. One noteworthy gift was a newly composed march titled For Sweden in Time, presented by Michael Budden, the commander-in-chief of the armed forces. Protecting the Queen's Comfort To ensure the comfort of 79-year-old Queen Sylvia, King Carl Gustav made the thoughtful decision to limit attendees' companions at the reception. This move prevented uncomfortable encounters, such as Queen Sylvia having to meet bees, commander-in-chief, mistress, Linda H. Stoff. A joyous and unifying celebration. The Jubilee celebration not only marked a significant milestone in King Carl Gustav's reign but also served as a unifying event for the Swedish people. The grand finale, with the royal motorcade and a ride on the royal sloop Vasorden, left a lasting impression of joy and gratitude among the thousands of subjects who lined the streets. Conclusion King Carl Gustav's 50th anniversary celebration was a resounding success showcasing his commitment to the Swedish people and their unity. As Sweden's beloved monarch, his reign continues to be marked by dedication, compassion, and a profound connection with his subjects.